Today, we're going to be creating our own Lego maze. I used two books for reference, Hello Ruby, Adventures in Coding, and Help Your Kids with Computer Coding, both of which are available in the main consortium. Now, take the templates that I got for you, um, and we're gonna try some experiments. But first, here are some words to remember. So let's create an algorithm to get us through this maze. I'm going to be using Yoda as my robot today. So I need to go step by step. So first, of course, we have to start. Let's see where he needs to move next. He moves forward two tiles. Then he turns right. Remember when you're going through this maze that this is going to be from the perspective of the robot. Next, he's going to move forward two tiles. Then he's going to turn left and move forward two tiles again. Let's see, he's going to turn left. Move forward two tiles. Turn right. Move forward one tile. And, oh no, we've run into a wall or a bug. So that's not the way we can get from one end of the maze to the other. So how do I debug this code? What steps do I need to change? So starting and moving forward, two tiles were okay. And turning right and moving straight for two tiles is also okay. Turning left also and moving straight for two tiles again was also still okay. But I think going left was the problem. So instead, we're going to try turning right. And then let's move straight again for three tiles and turn left. Move forward two steps again. Turn left. I don't want to run into the wall. Move straight for four tiles. Turn right, move straight for one tile, and we've reached the end. So that is how an, our algorithm is broken down step by step. And if you want to do a screen version of this, Lightbot on the Hour of Code website is fantastic. So now you have a lot of other templates in your packet even some instructions if then. You also have a few templates um, of graph paper to design your own maze. So what kind of code or algorithm can you come up with? It's time to try it yourself. Have fun!